Turi kumwe na Dr. Maltuch Enliko muri uh, you are welcome again sir in the show. Thank you. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> okay. I'm Dr. Martucci. I'm, I'm Italian. I'm studying in a university in Rome. I'm a doctor in pharmacy business administration, but I spent 24 years in the Civil Aviation Authority in Italy before to come here. When I came here in 2014, uh, there was Rwanda, so commercial aviation with the regulation, of course, already going, but they didn't have any regulation about the so-called general aviation and sport aviation. So I offer myself to prepare the draft. I'm not from here, so I just could have to do the draft. Mm -hmm. I did this draft, I gave to my colleagues in civil aviation, mm -hmm. but I followed the procedure. They, they sent this draft to the minister. Mm -hmm. Minister of State uh, for transport at that time was Alexis. And uh, of course, the procedure was to the prime minister and so on. Mm -hmm. I met the minister too. Mm -hmm. And uh, okay, uh, I've been happy with this kind of job made by me to help Rwanda. Uh, has been published in the in the Gazette on the 19th of May 2017. But this just was the first step because the, having the law, we can operate everybody. But we need something else. We need to have aircraft, to have investors, and so on. So I continue to do my job in Italy, contacting uh, factories producing this small aircraft because it's uh, cheaper, of course. And try to convince them, Rwanda, like I, I felt in love with this, with this country when I came here because it's a, a nice country, because it, I appreciate um, there is no corruption mm -hmm. and people is friendly and uh, everything is clean in order. Mm -hmm. So well, I, I try to convince some Italians to come and invest in this field. Mm -hmm. I found this company. The company name is ICP. It's in the northern part of Italy exactly in Castel Nuovo Don Bosco in Asti province. It is very well organized using some robots in its production chain and the aircraft are cheaper than other companies. This picture shows me just after finish my testing of Ventura aircraft. Talking with him and realizing we need something to start. Mm -hmm. We can't start with a flying school because it's more complicated. We need authorization and other things uh, by the government, of course, mm -hmm. Ministry of Education and so on. Mm -hmm. I've been in touch with the Yelka University. Mm -hmm. I met Professor Igamba, the founder, and then he introduced me Dr. Karambizi, is the person, principal of um, Polytechnic Institute. Mm -hmm. And they allow me to do some lesson or conference, we can say, mm -hmm. to the students to see if there was interest in these people mm -hmm. in this new field. Mm -hmm. I had a very good reaction, reaction mm -hmm. by them. Mm -hmm. I think now there are almost 20 people, say 20 students mm -hmm. studying in Yelke want to become pilot. Mm -hmm. We had <laughs> step by step. Mm -hmm. well, because not everybody is interested to become pilot, I want to be in the aviation field. Mm -hmm. And I, suppose, uh, I thought, to, to find another some more chance for these people was, means to uh, give the chance to become an aviation mechanic. Mm -hmm. I convinced this factory to send me, sorry, me to send to Yelke, not to me. Mm -hmm. This uh, an aircraft not assembled mm -hmm. without the engine, because the, the engine already assembled, mm -hmm. to start a new course mm -hmm. about how to assemble an aircraft. So to give point to the end of the course, of course, I had to talk with the Ministry of Education to be authorized and so on. But so they have a chance to become aviation mechanic. And so they can find a job even here in Rwanda, because you have already a company, a big aircraft like Rwanda, but in the future, even uh, I saw the I suppose police or Air Force in needs a small aircraft, so they can find a better job than... So step by step, we go ahead. I, I'm happy because I see the reaction of the people, I mean the students, they, they are calling me every day when we start, when we start. They have to be patient, like I'm patient. Mm. I really spent four years to organize all these things. Mm. Now things are, are going well because first of all, this company was available to send me the, the aircraft, otherwise I, we can't assemble anything. Actually, that's what I want to, 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 to talk about. Are the Italian investors willing really to invest in Rwanda? Yeah, I can talk what I said myself. Maybe I suppose this is the first person or the first company doing something not, not everybody can do. She had to send free of charges on aircraft, except the engine, to be assembled. Oh, but 
they know me, they, they know because I spent 24 years working in that field. I was checking the schools because I'm a pilot too. I was in, uh, doing the, all the flying school know me. Mm -hmm. And uh, at the same time, in the factories, because I visited. So they trust me, uh, by the way. But uh, I hope after this first step, mm -hmm. other people mm -hmm. uh, can follow him. Mm -hmm. And uh, let's talk about this. Uh, what are the benefits are you expecting to those, those students who are going to learn about assembling airplanes in Rwanda? Yeah, I suppose in, in, because everything you learn, a new thing, you have a new chance for you. At the moment, I, I know in, in, in Ilka, uh, they are studying about electricity and electronics. Mm -hmm. So it's another, it's ever a taking outside, mm -hmm. but because even in Rwanda is growing and it's going well, and I, I wish all the best for them. But in the in the future, I can think even a smaller aircraft like a, a private jet or so-called executive jet. They come here, they need the mechanic to... Uh, me, I'm a pilot, I can't touch the aircraft, I can't fly. Huh? So I, we need for the regulation, some somebody specialized in, in this field, me, me mechanic, to touch, you know, it was, um, to put in order to check the aircraft. So, they can uh, more choice to find a more qualified job than a uh, more simple job they can do now. Mm. That's all. Mm. From the start, those students should pay the school fees, things like that? Uh, the, the school fees is not my problem in the sense that this is a, a Yelka, they decide. So if, but if they want to come to me, but this pri privately, just a friend. I said, if you want uh, just to learn something, you can come to my, my office, you can see now our space enough. To just to teach the, the beginning to to learn to, to decide if you learn if you like this field, mm -hmm. I, I suppose yes because I see the reaction. The other day it was a, a is not important for you, but I like it because mm -hmm. they organize a, a group in, in WhatsApp uh, on their own. I didn't ask them to do it mm -hmm. to be in touch with me, mm -hmm. and uh, in the fact they call aviation mm -hmm. at uh, Martucci Consulting Limited. Mm -hmm. And it's, since yesterday, they start uh, calling me to say when we start to we want, we want to come here to, to be informed about this news. Mm -hmm. That's why, because I, I already knew you, mm -hmm. I prefer to start by you. You have more chance to uh, to communicate to people. Mm -hmm. A lot of people may he likes to do, but he doesn't know it's possible to do it. No, I'm here for, I'm here for that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, maybe uh, uh, putting there the courses, it's better. But uh, what, 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 what the feedback are you expecting maybe in the future, in the future year, you know, uh, by maybe building up the factory in Rwanda where yeah. they should uh, just practice what okay. they have okay. run well, before? This is our, another full subject. We went to step, step by step. We can show to have a baby, you need nice month. Mm -hmm. You can't run. <laughs> Even this thing, so Actually, but the problem problem it is this one you learn something but uh, at the end of uh, the courses you just go and sit without I'm, practicing what you're convinced learned. this is my conviction but anyway as for, now this, this, there's nothing no? mm -hmm. about this field mm -hmm. well, even people is afraid that people mm -hmm. I'm sure when the first one like this man is trusting me coming here mm -hmm. other people can they come more, more commercial side is maybe we can do business in this field mm -hmm. well, they are more able to to do something else mm -hmm. well, we can organize, of course, mm -hmm. having the authorization by the Ministry of Transport and the authorization of the Ministry of Education. Mm -hmm. But by the way, I'm used to it. It's like when you start eating, you want to eat more. Mm -hmm. <laughs> this is the same. The same. Mm -hmm. I'm sure when they see it works, other courses will follow. Having the people who could do this kind of job mm -hmm. will come other investors to organize straight the factory to produce, to, to produce it, to, to assemble here. Mm -hmm. What I said to them, I was talking with the minister, the transport. The advantage here is because the, the place, even to organize a factory, is cheaper because even the, the wages are general, lower than in, in Europe, and more. Having in the future, because you have to follow a procedure to be recognized in the, the new model by the authorities, but having a so-called aircraft made in Rwanda. You have the advantage to advantage to sell this this aircraft made in Rwanda to the all East African countries. With other advantage, don't pay the custom because of what the agreement you have. So we, we will have the same aircraft in Italy. We pay a price. We, you pay less here. So uh, when you pay less, people comes. Mm -hmm. That's all. Mm -hmm. Even me, <laughs> I want to buy one <laughs> on my own.